This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Stick around to see how they power our brand new website. Well, Michael, a longtime friend, has arrived. Instead of having the garage sale with GameStop, he brought it to me, and we're gonna see what's in the trunk. Do you have anything else in the rest of the truck? There's more in the back. I imagine maybe you got games back there? A little bit. We're just gonna kind of take it piece by piece, negotiate. I want you to be happy. Hopefully, we can leave a little room for us to make some money. So Michael is a friend of mine. We've known each other for 11, 12 years. We established the last time. I bought your entire garage sale. This time you brought it to me, so thank you. You're welcome. He's been reselling. He's the only other person that's been reselling that I know since he was eight years old. Yeah. So we met each other at your garage sale when you were 10 and I was 17. I bought this giant red Toys R Us, like new Super Mario Bros. Display. Complete display, I remember giant that. Giant standee yeah. thing. Actually traded you a, a Nintendo completed box yeah. for that. It was beautiful. It was, it was really nice. I like taking advantage of you, know, uh, little eight year old. <laughs> <laughs> a little 10-year-old hustler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Since then, we've done tens of thousands of dollars of deals back and forth. It seems to be quick and easy just to make a big old truckload and make a deal. So let's dive in. How many weeds you got? A lot. A lot of weeds. Yeah. Okay. So basically for me, if they're in very good condition, I can pay more. I'll make a sack of ones that I think can be better. qualified as better. Very good condition. And then I'll make you an offer on those. This one's pretty good though. Not bad. 80% of it roughly is tested, yeah. so it should be mostly good to go. We might find a couple duds, but not, not many. So how do you generally pick up all these all these games? Like, what's your... Crowd sales, Facebook marketplace deals, and when I do jewelry deals, I always ask. We established the last video I had with you, where I bought out your whole actual garage sale. Yeah. He does a lot of jewelry flipping, that's kind of the main hustle, and then um, firearms as well. So you have like three, like dominant categories yeah. that you can ask for. They're all like unrelated. If you're, if you're going to garage sales, like he has an advantage because he, he'll ask for gold, silver jewelry, firearms, and then might throw in video games. It depends on the area. You okay. know, if I'm in the country area, I'll stay away from video games and ask more guns and jewelry. Okay. But if I'm in like a really city country area, I don't want to ask if they got any guns because yeah, I'll, uh, yeah, true. It looked that funny. Yes. <laughs> that, yeah, that, that is one that I'm like scared to, to ask about, but I wouldn't have success at garage sales if I didn't ask at every sale. Do you share the same? You'll walk past, you know, lots of profit if you just keep staring at the baby clothes. I've had I've had a lot of uh, scores where it was like baby baby clothes and Christmas ornaments, yeah. and they brought out a Nintendo from the basement. So exactly. always ask, and then make connections. Well, I wouldn't be anywhere without connections. You yes. Know, you'd be Branded, you know, going to going to GameStop to make your profit. It's not worth it. No, no, it's a lot more fun to to know to meet awesome people like yourself and and make deals like this. It's a lot easier too. <laughs> we have one, two, three, four, five Wii's that are in pretty good condition. What do you think about 40 bucks a piece? Thinking that's good. All right, five Wii's at 40 bucks a piece. 200 bucks. And I appreciate you bringing them to me, so I can definitely pay a little better. <laughs> You're making my life easy. These ones acceptable. They still have cords and controllers with them all. Can you do 25 a piece? 30. 30? All right, I'll do 30. Perfect. I'll do 30. So we're at 290. I won't return them. Yes. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, Wii U, the crap most stanker. That one got attacked by the Black Panther. <laughs> yes. It looks like it. The gamepad is where most of the value is at. I don't know. What You shoot me a price. $40? How about 30? Perfect. 30 bucks. So we're at 320 now. Perfect. Moving on up. All right, Nintendo, 50 bucks. 370, let's go over to this side. You got a Sega Model 1 and a Sega Model 2. I could probably only do like 10 bucks a piece. You hear that? PS3, do you know how many gigs PS3 still in? That one's 320. Oh, it's 320. Okay. And it's clean. How about 70? 70 bucks. Ooh. You got a lot of 360s. There's three elites. One of them's the Modern Warfare 2, and then that one. 25 a piece? I'll do 30 a piece on it. There's a slim in there. I'll do 30. PS1 slim, a lot of yellowing, but it does have a good controller. 25? Done. Done. Oh, another PS1. 20? Yep. That's another 45. This is a, just an Xbox, no controller, right? Yeah, just power cord. Just power cord. 20? Yep. Another 65, and the final Wii U, let's try to get it to a round even number. We'll see what the even number so is. 65 plus uh, 75. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> Let's uh, use that calculator you just got in that last video. <laughs> We've got 750 now. Perfect. 750 even for the entire back of the truck. Full. But you still got more. Oh yeah. Let's check it out. Ready? So while Chase and Michael are deliberating, I wanted to remind you guys that we have a brand new website, caterpiecrew.com, C-A-T-R-P crew.com. And we made it using Squarespace. Their website builder is super easy to use with great templates. It's really easy to customize and make things look exactly how you want them to. We use the entertainment category templates as inspiration and actually went from there. Squarespace has ways for you to easily sell physical and digital products for your business, which is great if you're offering more of a service than a product. And then using their analytics is fantastic. It's easy to understand. You have access to tons of information and it's already helped us make educated decisions for our website. Head to squarespace.com slash Caterpie, C-A-T-R-P, for a free trial and 10% off your first domain or website when you're ready to launch. Okay. More games. We got the games, games, games back here. And controllers. First bin of controllers. First box of controllers. Do you have a, a thought on this box? Uh, my thought is to listen to your thought and then talk you up a little bit. <laughs> and they're all first party, right? Yeah. Yep. There's one we use. Xbox One. Okay. okay. Uh, how about 75? Ah. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> how about 100? How about 80? Yeah. 80 bucks. All right. We we remotes for days. I love the gold one. Yep. That's definitely my favorite part of this one. So, Golden Eye, bundled with Golden Eye, exclusive, 75. 100. 80. 85. <laughs> All right, 85. 85. <laughs> I need five bucks more for Wii Remote. Okay. It's all in there, except for Wii Sports? Yeah, all in there, and I think it's missing one. Missing one tray? Yeah. Okay. But everything else is all in there. Okay. Pretty clean violence. 50? 60. 55. 50. All right. That's that's the chase box. <laughs> this is the chase box. Let's bring this over to the table. This is the chase box. He, he know, you know me well. All right, Mario Kart. I can use these all day long. Three of those. We've got Wii Sports. One, two, three, four. Good night. Five, six, seven, eight. Sports Resort. Just one. Oh, okay. Two, three. New Super. Two of those, Mario Galaxy. All right, Smash for all three of them. It's a beautiful box. 60. 60 there. 104. It's good Wii Sports games. <laughs> so that'll work. I, I pay up for Wii Sports. <laughs> that'll work. All right, Wii Sports Resorts. You go with 15 and pop on those. So $45. How about 10 and 15? Another 25. 10 bucks across the board, 10 bucks each. I was like, dang, that really hurt. I was saying, $10 for the pie. 10 for the whole thing. <laughs> Should've went to GameStop. That would be awesome. <laughs> Hi. What's next? Games. Oh. Oh, we got some real good ones in here. <laughs> that's right, you told me about this one. Oh, man. You already know that's jumping out. Yeah. With the guide. Yeah, the guide is cool. Got the memory card. That is nice. Yeah. Let's see if the disc matches. Minor scratches, but nothing we can't fix. What does the guide go for? It's, it's up there. Is it up there? Yeah. It doesn't surprise me. 50, 60 bucks. Okay. We'll have to, we'll have to look at that one. Just so I make sure my math is accurate. Blitz League 2 is a good one. Yeah. 60 plus. Yeah. And it's complete. Be on the lookout for that one for sure. Sonic Unleashed, God of War, Need for Speeds, Midnight Club, popular games, some some solid ones. This is definitely the best of the batch. For those that don't know, Silent Hills on PS2, really on any system, are pretty sought after. And Silent Hill 2 is towards the top, especially complete. With the guide. With the guide. So complete, they go for about 130 to 150. And this will probably be on the higher end because of the sure. condition. And let me look at the guide. Yeah, 50 bucks. Yep. Just those, 150 bucks. 160. 155. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Not bad, not bad. I hope you paid a lot less than that. Oh, a little bit less. <laughs> okay, good. My favorite part about our deals yeah. is that mutually both ways, when I buy stuff from you, I try to get close to a double up. In this case, I came up more because it's really nice stuff. Sure. But you got this stuff for really good deals. You found it out in the wild. You're probably more than doubling up. Yeah. Is that fair to Try say? To. Yeah. Double, triple, maybe on some of it. Yeah. Well, we understand that we both got to make money. That's right. So we, you know, we help each other out. 
it's a win-win. So, and then last time you came, you came out. You met me at my storage locker. Yep. Bought a couple pieces out of there, and you straight up said, "I can get seven hundred bucks. I'll give you three fifty or four hundred. Exactly. And, and I do the same thing. I'll pay a little more if it's gonna sell tomorrow. Yeah. Know? So I think in that case you might have went four hundred because it was like an easy flip for you. Yeah. So I mean, I appreciate that. We don't even have to worry about anything. No, exactly. Like, I know you're gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest with you. We both know how to look stuff up. So why would I lie? You know? <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah, I could check it if I wanted yeah. to, but I, I don't. I don't need to. All right, rest of this box. And then you, you have more games? Yeah. You want to just try to do one giant deal to finish it? There is another like miscellaneous box with a few other Raider games in it. Do you okay. want to take all, everything out? Let's just, let's just finish it off. Okay. You know, Silent Hill. There's a couple of bite sized chunks. Nice. Yeah. I'll check through those. There's a Forza Collector's Edition and some decent stuff in there, the combo pack. Good. Nice. Okay, so we'll save the N64 for last. How about that? Do and you want me to bring the other box out besides N64? Yeah. yeah, let's grab the other box. There is some nice stuff in here. I kind of expected more junk, to be honest. Uh, he, he, didn't, he didn't fully tell me uh, everything he'd be bringing, that's for sure. And apparently he just picked up an N64 on the way here. He lives about an hour away from me. So making the trip count is important. Cores, miscellaneous cords. Okay. Yeah. There, the Genesis stuff in there, I'm pretty sure it works for the Genesis, but it also worked for a piano. You know what I mean? Oh, okay. Gotcha. It's one of those guys. Yes. <laughs> it's one of those guys. Yes. Okay. So miscellaneous. Ah, nice. Derek Jeter. I didn't know if that was anything. It is a rookie. This was one of those deals where, you know, there's a bunch of sports cards at the garage sale for a yeah. dollar, you know, a whole binder. Yeah, and I'm yeah. like, well, dude, this is something. Good old Derek Jeter rookie. I don't know if it's something something, but it's not nothing. Yeah. Right, so let's get like the best stuff. Let's do a deal on the best stuff first. This one's good, uh, bro. Did you know that? No, I didn't. I don't know what it goes for these days, but I've sold it a lot in the past. Okay. I would guess 20 bucks. What's your guess? <laughs> My guess was five. <laughs> okay. 15. Cool. Better stuff separated. 40 is probably the top end. All sure. right. Some of these are 10. A lot of 20, 15, 20s. 15, 25. So what if we just did 10 bucks a piece? I'll lose money on some. I'll make That's fine. a triple up on others. Okay. okay. Cool. You want to add more to that pile? <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't. <laughs> and then the rest. What do you think? I can't do a ton on them. No, I know. What do you think? I hate when you do that to me. <laughs> I don't like that first number. You don't I don't like the first number. <laughs> Nobody wants to start. <laughs> I could do two bucks a piece. Two fifty a piece. All right. All right, two fifty a piece. Deal. With the two hundred eighty bucks, there were, I don't know, two hundred forty divided by two dollars and fifty cents worth of games here. So two fifty a piece was two hundred forty. That puts us just under two thousand dollars at one thousand nine hundred and forty-nine. Yeah. What did you expect to get? Oh, roughly fifteen hundred to two thousand. Fifteen hundred. We kind we kind of get what's going on here, but we still have to finish with the N sixty four. After I make my offer, will you tell me what you what you bought this for? Sure. Let's check it out. And this was a Facebook Marketplace on the way down. It was a, no, it was a, me buying a Joe the Camel sign and asking about video games while I'm there. No kidding. Yeah. You didn't even go for video games. No. Just worked Everybody out. learn from this man. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that is a classic story right there. You like, want to see the sign? Yeah, I do. Sold Bigger. listings on eBay are 200 to 250. Nice. Double sided. Yeah, double sided. And it works. That's legit. Yeah. I don't smoke, but. <laughs> <laughs> You'll sell it. <laughs> All right, N64. This is a good one. So they bought it for $39.99. I think it's still worth at least that. Uh, did you know about the variant on this one? The Dash one? Basically, they patched something in the game, set it back, a new version, or, or it's whatever. Like how the switches are. Yeah, so there, there's not actually like a Dash one box. Like they never came with a box, it was just a cartridge. It was very interesting. And then you got. You didn't lie. Sports games for days. NASCAR NFL Blitz 2000 is deep. Event, World Tour, Showtime. Very fun game. 
It's like NBA Jam. Like just as good, honestly. Controller, got the memory pack, regular jumper. Okay. How about we do 120? 125. Perfect. Deal. We cross the $2,000 mark. What'd you pay? $40 with the sign. $40 with the sign. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> so triple up there, and then you're going to add it. Another 200 to 250. Yeah. to 250. It's a great score. So 1,949 plus 125 for the N64, and we crossed 2,000. We made $2,074. Hopefully, that's about what I'll make in profit. Yeah. And uh, I would assume you had less than 1,000 bucks into it. Definitely. Definitely. There we go. We both double up. It's a win-win. And that is how this thing works. Thank you guys for watching. Hit the like button for Michael, the man, the myth, the legend. We'll see you next time. Bartle do. Thank you.